April 2nd, 2017. April 2nd. 2017. Next round of podcasts. Um, what are we the talking old about? The old-fashioned podcast. The old-fashioned podcast. We're talking about there's going to be a, there's a new Dark Souls DLC. Uh, I'd like to We'll talk-, talk about both Dark Souls DLCs. Yeah, yeah. The newest one, the last one, is coming out, um, or has came out this last week. Uh, Persona Five is going to be coming out next week. Really pumped about that. Uh, talk about a little in uh, a little small game called Drawn to Death. Um, then uh, playing Pac-Man on Google Maps is back. Um, I don't know if you remember if, if you ever done that before. Uh, we'll talk about that. Um, and uh, maybe a couple other topics as as they spring up. So that's that's kind of the main things that we're going to talk about. Um, oh, and actually, we're I'd like to talk about uh, you know emulation versus having the actual physical content. Um, I'd like to get some of your thoughts on that and uh, share some of my thoughts. So I will try to emulate my thoughts as best I can through the technology yeah. process. So. Well, I, I appreciate that. I don't know how well that worked. That was kind of stupid. Um, but uh, we haven't actually done a podcast for a little bit. We took kind of a little bit of a break. Uh, unintentional, just life sometimes gets in the way. So uh, we're, we're back at it um, full force. So what do you want to talk about first? Well, let's talk about Persona 5. Persona 5. So Persona 5, I'm really pumped at I've never played... Uh, any of the old Persona games until uh, 4 came out on the Vita and it, I guess it was a remake of the 4th one um, or they added a few things or something and I mean that game I dumped so many hours in uh, is, is unbelievable I mean I I loved everything about it I didn't realize a game like that existed uh, you know where you work on social skills uh, you know you spend every day of your life going to school or going to work and then you spend your nights fighting enemies and trying to solve a crime. I mean, I absolutely amazing. And I've been really excited about Persona 5, but I've been keeping it on a low key. I don't want to know too much about it. Um, I, I want to be surprised more than anything. I'm so excited for it. Yeah, I would completely agree with everything you just said. I played the first two Personas back when they came out, I think, on PlayStation 1. I wasn't too impressed. Um because it was really slow going uh, you know the combat system the relationship system uh, it was a lot of grinding and a lot of uh, stuff I didn't understand because it was I was a teenager I ended up falling asleep a lot playing them yeah they, they weren't that great the third your, one yeah I know what you mean yeah the third one started getting better and then the fourth one you know they really they really pulled through with that one uh, took out all the tedious stuff running around way too much and uh you know, made the dungeons manageable, mm-hmm. uh, the character relationships more meaningful. Uh, you know, people had like I don't know personalities and whatnot. Right. Uh, you know, so and and they tried to do that with the third one, but it didn't. I don't know. I didn't really like it as much. Um, and the fifth one seems that they're just taking the fourth one and just taking it to the next level. And I think that's going to be a terrific game. Uh, you know, Atlas does a really good job of marketing, and I know you yeah. haven't seen very much, but you know they're really building it up. If you follow them, get their emails or whatever, you know they release a different character in a bio every so often, and mm-hmm. um, just keep teasing. You know, hey, we're gonna tell you about this new person and that new person, and uh, so far it looks fantastic. Yeah, you know, I know. I think when it when it was first announced, it was gonna be a PS3 game only. And I was like, okay, well, there's a reason to keep my PS3 around. Because PS4 was out, and they're like, hey, we already started a lot of our development on the PS3. We're going to go ahead and stick with the PS3. Um, and then they announced, oh, we're also going to bring it out on PS4. And I was like, oh, okay. But, I mean, I was I was down to just keep my PS3 relevant. And I would, uh, I mean, I did not care at all. That's how excited I was. I just, I, you know, just to, just to play the game, you know, um, definitely definitely worth keeping the ps3 out yeah i'm really glad that they decided not to do that i think that you know i I think that would have been a mistake and i'm glad somebody was smart enough to realize that well they they did it with the ps uh persona 4 though didn't they i think 
that came out maybe it was the end of the PS2's life cycle. Yeah, but it was already you know it had been out in Japan so long it was already for PS2 and it takes them so long to translate it. Yeah. Uh, from you know so in, in that case, in order to translate the software and the language would have been you know a much bigger deal. Yeah. But... Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah I'm I'm so looking forward to not interacting with you while I sink a hundred hours plus into Persona Five. Is that is that a multiplayer game? I don't know. I hope not. Yeah, no, it's not. It's not. Uh, that's funny. Um, yeah, no, we've been sinking too many hours together in Dark Souls. That uh, yeah, I definitely need a break from from you. Yeah, and I'm tired of sucking at Overwatch. God. Yeah. Well, I think we all kind of suck at that, but. But yeah. Except for Jose, oh my God, thirty kills. Jose's—he's like a freak of nature. He doesn't play it much, but when he does, I don't know if it's like all the energy drinks he drinks or or, or what drugs he does. But once he's once he's in the zone, I mean, it, it took him last night. We were playing. It took him ten minutes, and the next thing you know, I mean, like like two rounds, literally just two rounds, and then all of a sudden he was killing it. He went into beast mode. He's like he's like Marshawn Lynch for gaming he's he's crazy so yeah i feel like i feel like that's why persona 5 just speaks to me it's single player i can build my own self up and be awesome late in the game and don't have to compete with anyone uh, it helps your self esteem so, right that's what i'm saying so the game actually comes out this tuesday which is the 4th um so yeah did uh, you pre order it yeah i pre ordered it yeah you better I'm gonna, believe it i'm going to miss you yeah well uh, I'll miss you too, but uh, we'll definitely talk about it in the podcast, and I might even stream it um, on my Twitch channel, uh, twitch.tv slash buttermilkmike. Thanks. Wow, way to plug yourself. I'm not, hey, hey, you got to plug where you can, 